Liam, congratulations. 4-3 win over world champion Mark Selby. That must be a very satisfying result. Yeah, it's you know up there with the... The way I handled it as well was the, my most sort of pleasing thing. Um, I stayed calm throughout the match and, and took my chances and made it difficult for, for Mark. Yeah, you, you obviously did stay calm throughout the match. I think before it, you were saying the key against Mark is to sort of stay patient. Mm. Uh, how, how difficult can that be sometimes when you know he's he's you've no almost nowhere to go with him at times because he's such a good break builder and he's obviously such a good tactician as well. Yeah, he's all, all round amazing. Um, I do think the key with Mark is to stay patient, but it is very hard because like my natural instinct is to sort of attack and be ultra aggressive and um, play that way. But I think the key is to, you know to stay stay just. Just there on the side of a little bit more caution, because he, if if you play open, he can really sort of, you can never get a chance if he's sort of so good at mopping up and so good at keeping you out. And when you got that chance at the end, you you pounced and got yourself over the line, so that it must give you a lot of confidence. Yeah, I held myself together uh, really well towards the end. Uh, just just a good break, and um, I think I played the balls in the right order and played the right shots at the right times. So um, yeah, just onwards and upwards to try and get a run here. And he's a player that you, know, you have beaten three times in your career, so you, know, you must take a, a bit of pride to you know, have a few good results against a player of Mark's calibre. Yeah, definitely. Uh, obviously, off the back of them wins, I've not gone on to have runs in tournaments, which is what I'm after. So, uh, next match against Michael White will be will be as tough. Um, great player, come through in the junior ranks. So, yeah, looking forward to another good match. Yeah, where do you feel that? this week in terms of maybe this could be the week where you do go on that kind of big deep run in an event? Maybe, yeah, but you can't you can't raise your expectations because of like one good victory you've sort of got to, you know, keep your feet on the ground and, and just get on with the job and prepare right, practice, you know, eat and sleep well sort of thing. So again just reset and come back tomorrow. And I suppose part of that, you know, difficulty in having the consistency of your career has obviously been the fact that you've had the health issues with Crohn's and and things. Do you feel in a really good place with all that and everything at the moment? Yeah, definitely. Um, been vegetarian for like sort of over a year now, so that's really helped. I've been consistently eating good and I kept my fitness okay, not as good as it was years ago, but um, yeah, just everything in my life is really really good at the minute, so I'm in a in a good place and. You know, that can only help on the table.